<coughs> What's good, YouTube? Welcome. <laughs> What's good, YouTube? Welcome back to another video on the Delaware family. And in today's video, we got a reaction to the 2021 predictions. I was sitting here and I was thinking, yo, what can I react to? And I was like, bro, 2021 predictions. Like, what are the predictions? Like, some of the Simpsons or whatever people have. And uh, maybe they'll come true. I don't know. So, today we're going to check a video out and see what predictions they have for 2021. Hope you guys do enjoy this video. If you do, get this video to 25 likes. And uh, without further ado, let's get straight into the video. Let's get it. Top 10 scary 2021 predictions worse than 2020. What can be worse than 2020? <laughs> what can be worse than 2020? But let's get straight into it, man. 2020 has been one hell of a year. A lot of people think that this year is cursed and that when 2021 comes, everything will just fix itself and go back to normal. I don't know. So I have some heartbreaking news for you. It's only going to get worse. It's not like the earth <laughs> resets itself at the end of every year. Although I wish True. that was the case. So Yeah, hold on. like I get what people be like, it's gonna be a better year and stuff, but really, like coronavirus is still a thing, so we still may get shut down. But you still got thing on the positive side. It's still gonna be a great year. It's a start over. A little bit, sort of, you know. Hey everyone, 2021 might be worse than 2020. Hey everyone, what's up and welcome back to Most Amazing Top 10. I'm your host, Lindsay Ivan, and today I'm bringing you the top 10 scary 2021 predictions worse than 2020. Right, let's get to it. Before we begin, I do have some good news, and that is that we have another channel called Top 10. Hey, you talking too much, my guy. You talking too much, cuz. Everyone thinks that 2020 is the worst year and nothing will be able to top it. Eh, just wait and see. According to clairvoyant Baba Vanga, she predicted that 2021 will be filled with great suffering and disasters. She said, and I quote, the world will suffer from a lot of cataclysms and great disasters. The consciousness of people will change. Difficult times will come. People will be divided by their faith. We are witnessing devastating events that will change the fate and destiny of humanity. Great. Now she didn't say what exactly these devastating events are, but with everything that's currently going on in the world right now, I'm sure it'll have to do something with all that. So buckle your seatbelt. It's gonna be a rough and intense year. Coming in at number nine, we have artificial intelligence. Everyone needs to throw out their Amazon Alexa, Roomba, smart fridges, smart watches, and whatever other AI products you have. Why? Because in 2021, artificial intelligence is said to become smarter than human intelligence. And this is going to result in them taking over the world. Nostradamus predicted that, and I quote, the moon in the full of night oh, over the terrible. high mountain. The new sage with a lone brain sees it. By his disciples invited to be immortal. Eyes to the south, hands and bosoms, bodies in the fire. Okay, I didn't understand anything I just read, and I know it seems very cryptic, but a lot of people are convinced that he was referring to artificial intelligence overthrowing humans. Soon we're going to create robots that will be too if smart think for their that, own good. Maybe it's already too late. If they think that, why do they keep making stupid robots? Hi, bro. In our eighth spot, we have the mind transferring. Okay, this one is really, really strange. But basically, it said that in 2021, we will have the technology to upload our brains into a computer. Uh, no. I literally just finished saying how artificial intelligence is going to take over the world. Let's not become robots. I have no clue where this prediction came from, but someone predicted that we will have the ability to basically transfer our minds into a computer. But by doing so, this will kill our human selves. I don't know what happens after that. Like, do they know that they're in a computer or is it just like a way for us to browse through Why? their mind and memories? It's so trippy. Please, let's just stay away from that. It's gonna end badly. That's my prediction. In our seventh Why? spot, we have the re-election. Oh, so for all you Trump haters out there, it's predicted that he will be re-elected, which is going to be very problematic for America. A lot of people are concerned over the way he is 
is treating the pandemic. America has the highest amount of COVID-19 deaths and the numbers are rising. He just can't grasp the severity of the pandemic. On top of that, he was asked how he felt about the fact thousands of Americans are dying every day from the virus and he replied with, they are dying, that's true. It is what it is. So it's predicted that if Trump is re elected- Yo, but uh, the re-election, that'll be crazy, you know what I'm saying? But um, we have to see if it comes true. You know what I'm saying? We have to see if it comes true. Then the cases will continue to rise in America. That's very scary to think about. Moving on to number six, we have the natural disasters. The earth has faced a number of devastating fires this year. From the Australian wildfires that occurred earlier this year that destroyed more than 6.3 million hectares of land, to the current California wildfires that show no sign of stopping. These fires have been disastrous. This year alone, nearly 40,000 wildfires have burned over 4 million acres. And in 2021, they're only going to get worse. Climate change is a real issue, and we only have a couple of years left before we basically kill the earth. Next year, we're going to experience warmer and drier conditions and increased droughts, which wildfires thrive in. But we have more to worry about than just forest fires. Because of climate change, we are going to be facing more natural disasters, like tsunamis and hurricanes. We are now at our fifth and halfway mark with the I ain't pandemic. never been in the tornado though. I know, you know I don't everyone wanna be. hates the pandemic and social distancing and and quarantine, but it's not going to end anytime soon, yeah. sadly. In fact, I didn't figure experts that. are convinced that towards the end of 20. I kind of figured it was gonna keep going just because, like, our we, we we dumb and we we still going out, we still doing this, we still doing that, and we're not really helping it. And everybody keeps spreading it, so I really didn't think it was gonna end. You know what I'm saying? 20 and into 2021, it's going to get worse again, particularly areas where it gets colder during the winter months, like. Canada, yay for us. So researchers have found that viruses tend to thrive during the colder months. So they are convinced that December to March will be really bad for the virus. There will be more outbreaks and cases. That's how it was Another last expert year, believes that from here on out, every winter COVID will come back and there will be another outbreak. Every winter, I wish I was kidding. We might get the virus under control, but every winter, it could come back. That's the worst news ever. Every winter, COVID can World come War back. 2021. Why do you these scary pictures? Be We face World War Three. Tension is rising between countries, especially now because of the situation we're all in. In fact, this was a prediction made. Bro, I just turned 18 too. They better not call me, please, bro. Please, bro. I just want to live my life. I just want to live my life. I don't want to be out here shooting dudes. By Nostradamus. I don't know what they they'll call us, he but predicted, and I quote, I guess we'll have to see. In the city of God, there will be a great thunder. Two brothers torn apart by chaos. While the fortress endures, the great leader will succumb. The third big war will begin when the big city is burning. Oh my God, when the big city is burning, California is burning. So a global war might just break out between the most powerful countries in the world in 2021. And our third spot, we have the asteroids. It's crazy to think about how small Earth is in comparison to the universe. Like we're just a helpless little planet. At any second, some massive asteroid could come hurling down towards the Earth and kill us all. Scary thing is, in 2021, it's predicted that bigger asteroids will come closer to Earth. Apparently, there's going to be a lot of close calls. So not only are there going to be more asteroids getting close yeah, to my Earth, backyard. but they're going to be way bigger as well. All you need is one of these bad boys to enter our Earth's atmosphere and mm -mm, we're done. Rest. Let's not jinx it though. Think positive thoughts. Coming in at number two, we have the apocalypse. Just when you thought it couldn't get any worse, bam, life as we know it might just completely get wiped out in 2021. A bunch of futurists believe that 2021 is the end of times, but they never told us how it's going to happen. Maybe the virus is incurable. Shut up, they don't know. They said the same thing in 2012. Jesus gonna come back one day. And don't nobody know when. Slowly but surely, we will all get infected and die. Who knows? 
gnomes. But here's the thing, a couple of months ago people discovered that in the Ethiopian calendar, 2020 is actually 2012. And remember that huge scare we had back in 2012? That's when everyone said the world was ending. Now clearly, that didn't happen. But if they are right and the world is going to end in 2012, well this year is technically 2012, which means that we're all dead by 2021. And in our number one spot, we have the continual outbreak. My camera finna die. good news. Hurry up. Got some bad news. Good news, we might get a vaccine for COVID-19 eventually. Bad news. In 2021, more outbreaks are going to occur from different viruses. So child astrologer Abiga Anand actually posted a video on his YouTube channel on August of 2019 where he predicted a pandemic. Huh. Recently, he posted another video saying that next year in 2021, more viruses will come, resulting in more outbreaks. He predicts that some of these outbreaks- Yeah, wasn't well, there like a another COVID-19, like another version or type or something? So I guess- Will be more severe than COVID. Great, that's just what I needed to hear today. This is such a depressing video. <laughs> but that's all for today's video. Let's move on to our comment shout out portion. I, I feel like um, they're predictions, so we'll just have to see if they come true. You feel me? Only time will tell. If they, only time will tell if they come true or not. But hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. If you did enjoy this video, give this video 25 likes. My camera's finna die, so I gotta make it quick. Hopefully y'all 2021 is going good. And I love you guys. And until next time, it's been Deadway. I love you guys. And we out. Peace. Be this way. It could be this way. No escaping. There's no escaping. There's no escaping. There's no escaping.